Campus. Decision 2016 coverage now. The spotlight shifts to Wisconsin as our state's primary election edges ever closer. Ohio Governor John Kasich is already in our state stumping for votes ahead of the April 5th election. He met up with our Katie Crowther tonight who filed this report. Supporters of Senator Bernie Sanders working away at his Milwaukee headquarters. Not far, Hillary Clinton's camp is just as focused. This room is where Chelsea Clinton will greet Milwaukee voters on Thursday. She's making stops in Wisconsin ahead of her mom. It's Ohio Governor John Kasich who's getting a head start here. He's at a fundraising event in Milwaukee tonight and a town hall meeting in Wauwatosa tomorrow. He has secured the support of several Wisconsin politicians, including former Governor Tommy Thompson. I'm the only one that can beat Hillary Clinton. I mean, the polls have come out. If you look at all registered voters in America, they're more excited and optimistic about my candidacy than anybody else. A new NBC News national tracking poll shows support for Donald Trump at 45 percent, Ted Cruz at 24 percent, and Kasich at 16 percent which is up 4% just from last week. We're emerging and we're competing all across the country. Meanwhile, Trump has opened a campaign office in Menominee Falls and Senator Ted Cruz arrives here tomorrow. He'll be at an event in Pewaukee hosted by 620 WTMJ's Charlie Sykes. Cruz too is getting endorsements from many state leaders. Now, Kasich was here last year for a campaign stop, and today he was quick to remind us of the good luck that he brought the Milwaukee Bucks. The last time I was here, I practiced with the Milwaukee you. Bucks, you had a good shot. and as a result, they beat Golden State. Yeah, you remember that? The Bucks snapped that Warriors 24-game winning streak. Today's contest.